about this V to V vehicles to vehicles talking to each other. Yes. Okay. Did you read the article? No. Okay. But I know what you're talking about. You know what I'm talking about. All right. Well, I'm reading the article and Caleb says it's a good thing that, Caleb's my son, um, these vehicles uh, have an engineer designing how they talk to each other because he goes, imagine if it were the character of the driver was taken on by the vehicle and then they started talking to each other. For example, there would be a lot more arguments there. There's a lot of red rage. <laughs> there. There's a lot of red So, example, we have two women going, to, and they're going to meet at an intersection. So, Amanda, you tell us. What would the two women have, how would the cars communicate? Well, personally, I, I'm supposed to say that again. <laughs> they would compliment their shoes, which basically would be their tires and wheels. That's the first thing they would do. Compliment those things. And right. Or say, oh, she's she's got her hair done much better than me. Uh, or, which would be you know, their, which would be or their they, Yeah, or they would, yeah. since they're going to have and, a meeting, they would have to decide who's bringing the potato salad. Right. And who's bringing and the plan corn. Out everything and and like, plan it all. Well, yeah. Unfortunately, one of the cars will take it as an insult and they won't talk to each other for the next 30 days. Right. <laughs> <laughs> Very good. Okay, now let's try, let's say it is a... Uh, Husband and wife happen to be meeting at an intersection. They won't talk to each other for 60 days. Right. <laughs> exactly. So then, yeah, that could happen. Or you have the, the wife going on and on and on about, you know, the, the meeting, you know, and how you're driving too fast and you don't know where you're going and those types of things. And the husband looking up from the steering wheel going, yes, because that's what we do. Right? Very few words. You may Very leave. few words. That's exactly right. Very few words and they're usually wrong. And they're usually always wrong. wrong. <laughs> always. <laughs> always wrong. Okay. So then, um, what about this? You've got uh, college students driving around a college university, and you have a guy and a girl, male and female college students, meeting at an intersection. What are the cars going to say to each other? They will collide. Uh, <laughs> yeah, because. <laughs> there is an attraction. Yeah, exactly. They're going to collide. It's, so it won't work in that way. It won't, yeah. The, the, the guy is going to be thinking about checking out the cars, taillights, it's not going to work, it's going to be like Everything that. is not supposed to be checking Everything out. Everything is not supposed to be checking out, yeah. exactly. Mm -hmm. and, and then um, the other idea or uh, question we had was what happens during that, um, shall we say, female time of the month? Hmm. I'm not going there. <laughs> <laughs> she just got a little awkward. I'm not going there. <laughs> Well, I mean, think about it. Now you're talking we had 90 husband, days of no communication. We had the husband and wife thing earlier. Now we've got the situation where the wife is totally silent. The husband's car comes into the intersection and she purposefully slams him in the side of the car. And it's his fault. And it's his fault. <laughs> it's still his fault. And we won't forgive you for a long time. Uh, and like, you're probably not going to forgive me for bringing this into the conversation. And then we'll probably cry for a while. There you go. <laughs> okay. So... So we are all agreement, all in agreement that we're glad that engineers have decided how they're going to communicate instead of the drivers of the Yes, vehicles. we're in agreement, and that agreement means there's going to be a lot of not talking to each other. <laughs> Correct. Okay. I think we agree. We agree. All right. That we, is... adjourned? Amanda. Roger. And Dan in the morning. Thank you.